welcome back viewers and subscribers uh it's a new month i hope you all got into it with better hopes and a renewed uh, resolve uh, we are about to get over winter so i believe that everybody uh, is gearing for the beginning of spring but we begin this week and this month with a lot of sad news especially you would know about the rape of uh, at least eight women in the Kruger stop area um, just a few days ago we are told that uh, about eight women uh, were raped there while shooting a, a music video uh, there is no other way to describe this kind of an incident other than calling it what it is. It is a barbaric act, it is an inhuman act, uh, it is a dastardly act, and it is an act which must be punishable uh, in the harshest of ways. Uh, it is our sincere hope and prayer that the police are going to account for the real culprits behind this uh, and that the justice system will deal harshly with them because uh, we all know what a kind of a crime rape is because it takes away uh, a lot from the victim there is no way to recover for the rest of their life the victim will be traumatized uh, they will be stigmatized even in the society in which they live uh, so we hope that the police are going to account for the culprits behind this uh, what we know so far is that uh, at least 80 people have been arrested uh, but what worries us is that uh, so far we are told that these are uh, illegal minors we are told that they are uh, illegal immigrants we are told that they've been arrested for various crimes uh, so far no none of them has been confirmed to be one of or some of the culprits we hope that uh, as the dna samples are going to be taken from them also those who participated in this dastardly act of rape will be accounted for it was it is our fervent hope that uh, none of the innocent uh, people uh, are going to be punished for the crimes they did not do it is our hope that those who committed this dastardly act will be accounted for and that they will meet the harsh uh, punishment that they deserve because there is no way to def I mean, to describe them other than that they are beasts so we hope also that the women that uh, were victimized by these beasts uh, are going to be uh, given the maximum uh, support that they need the maximum treatment that they need we pray that they were not infected uh, by the i mean by stis uh, especially hiv and aids because we know that there is no way this can be cured uh, on top of the trauma we don't expect them to also uh, be affected by any form of, uh, of illness or disease. Uh, we also hope that they are going to get the maximum psychological help that they need. They need counseling. They need all forms of support. Uh, let's render it to them. But also, it is my appeal that whoever knows or has knowledge of the people that committed these crimes, we have not yet been accounted for, please uh, dial the nearest, uh, the, 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 the number for the nearest police station or report this to the nearest police station because there is no stopping these criminals from continuing to do what they've uh, done imagine if it was your sister your, your 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 younger sister your daughter who got victimized in this kind of manner so please report this to the nearest police station and it is also our fervent hope that the police are going to continue searching for the remaining of these criminals and arrest them so that they are brought before uh, justice and they are punished for their crimes so this is what we had for you this morning please subscribe to this channel like this video and share it we'll be back with uh, more broadcast about this and any other issue that is going to arise but for now it's bye from me